What's happening everybody? Street Pilot back here, and we are going to play something different today besides Ace Combat. This is going to be my first other game to play, but I'm not going to do a full playthrough of this. I'm just going to do kind of a little throwback, if you will. I'm just mess around on Need for Speed, the old Need for Speed 2015 to celebrate Heat's release, since when Heat drops, I'm going to be out of town recording with my band. I decided to go back and play Need for Speed 2015 for a little bit. And I decided to play with the one car that we're not going to get a Need for Speed Heat, thanks to the manufacturer. It's not EA's fault, surprisingly. But the Toyota Supra is not going to be a Need for Speed Heat, which really bums me out, because Toyota doesn't want to promote street racing. But we're going to fire this game up and enjoy the Supra in this game. This game was supposed to be a revamp of the franchise, and it was hit and miss. There's spots that hit and their spots it missed. It's just kind of, it tried. I'll give them props for that, it tried. Payback tried a little better, although it took cops out of free roam for some reason that I will never understand. You can only trigger them through like certain special events that are specifically made to get away from the cops, but to a certain point. And they updated that mode over time to make it a little better, a little more fun, but it's still not that great. There she is, my 2015 Mustang GT. This thing's kind of my baby. We're not going to take that out for a spin today. This is our focus, the Supra. We're going to select it and see what's up with it. Uh, it's been so long since I played this game. I don't even know what to do here. How do I just view it? I want to just look at it. Oh, here we go. It's right here, probably the eyeball icon. I forgot why I put that wing on it. Just a big window sticker on the back, because why the hell not? Oh, it's already tricked out. I'm not going to go through that whole process, because I want to go strictly gameplay. But I do want to paint it up a little different. Because there was one profile I had, like a really sharp shade of blue. Might have been this one, actually. Save changes to... Oh, there we go. Go back to that one. Lose my changes, why not? It's so weird I you have to like share it to a thing, even if you just want to paint your car a different color. That's one thing I never really cared much for. There we go, we're gonna slap that old blue one I have on there. And we'll go back to visual. I wanna do something with the hood. I thought I could make a carbon fiber, I guess not. That's right, everything else is pretty aftermarket on it. Like, these cars are beautiful stock, but... Yeah, I, I ain't doing that. The cars are gorgeous stock as it is, but even in some of these aftermarket parts, they're not too ricey. I mean, that's just... That's just dumb. We're gonna cut slits into it, and then boom, that's your one option. That's the one thing that bummed me out about this game, is you literally get one option for half the cars. Like, one bumper, one or two bumpers, and then that's it. Versus, like... Midnight Club 3, that had like 20 different bumper options. That's where, in my opinion, games kind of started going backwards. Like, no parts for the headlights. I don't think there's any aftermarket taillights, even. Oh, wait. Oh, snap. Okay, the one other option are these taillights. I may as well just keep them stock. Let's go edit the wrap and see how we could put a carbon fiber hood on this thing. Uh, gotta add decal. I see the master of customizing cars way back then. Midnight Club Los Angeles and like the first Forza Horizon I spent so much time on. Just to, like make replica cars and whatnot. It's truly interesting. Okay, why can't I see these now? This is... There we go. That's how we get them up above. Cool. And then I will save these changes. I had to like clip two other parts off because I couldn't figure out how the hell to do this editing. Once I get the hang of it, it's not too bad. Can I change the exhaust pipe on it? Pretty sure I can. I got just a stock one? What am I doing? Yeah, I'm going to put that on my Super. Now it's going to ruin it. I like that style. I'm gonna go with that one. I'm pretty sure my performance is up to par, so now we finally leave the garage and take this thing for a spin. 
Alrighty, here we go. Probably should have took that wing off it, but hell with it. It's customized. Well, there's a player right there, so that's great. Off to a great start already. Alright, now I need to figure out how to replay this game, because I know the controls are a little funny. Okay. Well, I heard a cop somewhere in the background there. Maybe it's just part of the song, I don't know. Oh, we're already up to 90 in fourth gear. I don't know how modified this thing is. Probably even that modified. Cruise right on by the cop shop. No cops sitting out there. And if there was, we'd lose them in a heartbeat anyway. We'll go this way. Oh, God. I almost hit that post there. There's the nitrous button. I think I just got time refill just refills over time though I don't have to like drift or drive like a maniac to do it. This is a random player doing donuts back there. Okay then, you, you do you buddy. There's downtown in the distance you can see and you can't go to it. Can't go to it at all. The whole part of the city is just like sectioned off. This is what I mean by stuff that's just hit and miss about the game. Okay, it's like a top out around like 160. Oh, there's a seventh gear yet? Holy crap. Alrighty. We'll do one of my favorite things, is just sit here. What's the e-brake? X? Look at that exhaust just spitting flames. Yeah, give me a second, buddy. I'm showing off my backfiring exhaust. I think it backfires almost a little too much. And like the new one, they're gonna exhaust you, so you can like control the rasp and the loudness of it. It's crazy. Exhaust tuning. Who would ever imagine that would be a thing, right? Anyway, we are going to... That's the wrong button. Where's the map? There we go. I have to press up. And it keeps driving. I forget, because you can't can't pause this game. They fixed that in Payback. But this one in Rivals, you can't pause. Let's see, what have we even got going on? Oh, I gotta use someone else's car against that. There's a speed challenge. I'm just gonna find a race. That's, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm not gonna do any of the story stuff. And you know, we'll put her out there. That's oh, just down the block anyway. So anyway, make a U-turn where possible. I see a possibility right here. And we are on the way. Yeah, I figured take the super out for a quick spin, just for old time's sake, and for the sake of nostalgia. I want to make a little mini-series called Nostalgia Trip, where I go back to games and just, you know, like, do an episode of playing that game and horse around for a minute or two. Maybe make a part two, or maybe even then, make a walkthrough of this video too at some point if you guys are interested. Start the event. Do a couple races, get into some trouble with the cops, just see what happens. Maybe the cops will crash a race. I mean, it's kind of loose, they just kind of show up and you lose them in a second. There we go. Okay, my bad, dude. That's a skyline. My ultimate rival. Probably hope so I don't nod my head along to the music. Oh god, I'm losing it already. Nitrous, let's go. Up to speed. And I'm out. And the soundtrack wasn't bad for racing, that's for sure. Maybe drifting is just better than turning. I think that might be the case in this game, I don't know. All I know is I'm in third place, and I just... Oh, no, I'm in fourth place. Out of seven. That's weird. Yeah, it's going to take me a second to catch these guys, if I catch them. I've picked a hard race, after all. Come on, we can catch them. We can catch them. Oh, it doesn't say how much space I got left or anything. How much area I got till the finish line. Oh, it does. I got about two miles. Maybe I can make that work. Bust a fat drift around there. Gun it with some nitrous. Uh, and we got a beamer up front. Well, not up front, but in front of me. Which is front enough for me. Oh god. There we go, hit that checkpoint. We're gonna catch them. We'll catch these guys. We still have like around a mile and a half. I mean, less, but we'll catch them. We got an STI, and who's up front there? Oh, it's the Porsche. Of course it's a Porsche up front. Those things are track monsters. Oh, we got a mile left now. We got a mile left. Come on, catch him, catch him, catch him. 
Come on, 2JZ. Give me some of that legendary power, damn it. Okay, they're taking the outer route for some reason. We got a half a mile. We got a half a mile to win this race. We'll get him. We'll get him. We're gonna get him. We're gonna get him. Right, right here's the spot, right? No. No, I'm gonna come in second. No! Man. I made this game to put the street in the street pilot, and here I am losing my first damn race. It was a hard race, though. That's my excuse. It was a hard race, yeah. And we're in the hills, which is like my kind of least favorite area. Yeah, and all that reputation for whatever reason. Alrighty. Well, we're in the hills, and we got a little chain, it looks like, here, I guess. Maybe. Are they going to roll with me? Are we going to get some crew points here while we're at it? Yo, why, why are y'all slowing down to like the speed limit? What are you doing? I mean, it's kind of cool. All the racers are just cruising with me right now. Oh, well, that was a failure. So now that I win the race, y'all are just going to follow me. No one's going to pass. Like, I could hit the brakes right now. There we go. Now someone's passing. I could challenge him. Let's do it. Uh, let's do a let's do a sprint. Hell. Oh God. So they're just gonna throw a U-turn in there like that? Man, this is longer than the last race I did. This is still one v. Oh, it's four. That's cool. I challenged one dude, and three of his buddies just joined it for the hell of it. Oh God. Okay. I think I see the Porsche up there too. So this is already off to a great start. I'm going to beat you guys this time. Hey, look, it looks like the sun's starting to come up. But well, once we get down there, it's going to go right back down because it's only nighttime in this game. Which I don't mind. Some critics hated that. I thought it was some kind of a decent concept. Reminds me of Underground. I kind of didn't care for the whole slight daylight at times thing. Like, just keep it nighttime, you know? That was a horrible turn, but it still got me ahead. left there. That Porsche is ahead of me once again. But it's not the one at first. You're not the one I lost to, but it would still be nice to beat you. See, now it's almost pitch black again, because the sun went back down, if you will. Okay, I need to get some different tires on this thing or something. This thing is horrible with handling. Maybe that's why I had this car off to the side and used the Mustang instead, because this thing was so, like, hit and miss. The first time I ever played through this game, this car was a beast for me. We got a mile. We got a mile and I'm dead last all of a sudden. I don't know how it happened. Probably because of this rubber band and AI. I guess this game is famous for that. Yeah, how with this. I'm, I'm done with this race. How do I quit the damn race? There we go, leave him at. I'm just going to take this back to the garage. Where the tires at? That's what I'm all about, those tires. Let's see, I'm trying not to go too grippy. Man, I wish tires in real life were 450 bucks. Holy crap. So now that we got some better tires on this thing, let's try another race and see what happens. Hopefully I won't quit out of this one here. Wrong button, I gotta press up. I think select, hit select would open the map, but no. Here we go, we'll go to this hard mode and I'll teleport there. This part of town seems to have more of the cops popping around. Anytime I want to get into a cop chase, I go to this part and pass the police station. Oh boy, is this going to be a highway only one? We're going to find out. I do like how these events start. I will give them that. Okay, they're all up above there. Three mile long race going right into the town, so it's not going to be a highway-only race. Uh, well, it looks like we're getting back on the highway, so maybe it is a highway-only race. And they're all just stick staying ahead of me. And then that happens, so now they're really going to be ahead of me. Is the whole race in oncoming traffic? Holy crap. Okay, now we're on the right side of the highway, so cool. This is like the one time I'm thankful the traffic is really, like, thin. This traffic is definitely not these games some strong points. Uh, 
still feels weird. Like, the handling in this game's just been weird. That's why I don't play it too much. Like, right now, it feels alright, but if you, like, try to turn without drifting, then the game just doesn't know what to do, it feels like. Now when I tap the handbrake, so... It wants to turn a little more naturally. But even then, it's almost like you have to hit that E-brake to try to get a good squeeze in there. You want to go full grip, it ain't happening. Need for Speed Heat's supposed to let you do grip builds where, like, grip won't help you turn. Excuse me. Wow, that's the end of the race already, and I'm only in fourth place. Maybe third? Fourth place? Oh my god, this is ridiculous. I don't know what I'm doing wrong, I'm just driving. Yeah, whatever, I earned a little bit of rep, but nothing worth a damn. That cop's after someone else. He ain't after me. <laughs> That's kind of cool, though. He just showed up. You, come after me. He's not coming after me. He can give a damn less about me. What's he going to do? There's like, oh, just despawned. All the races there just despawned. Did you guys see that? Whatever then. Maybe maybe I'm just losing my mind. Here's a hard race I haven't won yet. I'm sure this one will do just fine, right? See what happens here. Gee, they already start like a mile up the road if you look on the map. Holy crap. Okay, I got four miles to do my thing. So maybe this time I won't burn myself. They're just staying ahead. I literally can't catch them. They're just staying up there. I was going to start cutting corners like that, right? It doesn't seem to affect your handling if you drive on grass for a second. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm almost not in last place. That dude about intercepted a race. What's up, Tiffany? Now my cat hopped on my lap. I do like the hazards when you get in a hard uh, collision. I really like that feature. Oh, Tiffany, I want to pet you, but someone, EA, won't let me pause the game. Holy crap, man, they're just bombing right by me. Come on, I cannot escape sixth place. I'm not going to win this. This rubber banding AI just likes to stay ahead. It's just what it does. I had a feeling that was going to happen. There's a traffic car you're automatically magnetized to it. A perfect moment. So, oh, there we go, I guess. Yo, get out of my way. Man, I cannot catch first place. I can't even touch first place to save my Like, I got a feeling it ain't gonna happen. I'm not gonna win this. I got a mile left. All these guys in front of me. I've passed one dude. Third place. Can I keep it? Nah, this Cayman ain't gonna let me keep it. Uh oh, we got a charger in the race. Get out of my way, dude. Come on. And I got more people passing me. Yo, they just bombed on me at the last second. Oh, well, now I got a cop. Give me that third place. I'll take third, I guess. I don't know why that cop just decided to come after me. Yay, $2,500. If I don't get busted, I might be able to keep it. I mean, I'm not going to get busted. If this thing can't outrun a cop, I might just sell it. The cop's already gone. I'm in cooldown mode already. And I already escaped. Just like that. We are back at the garage to see what more we can do to this car. We can take Manifold, maybe a better intake will get it. Why the hell not? It's 1500 bucks. Better fuel system, maybe? Oh, it's five grand. Engine block. What can an engine block give me? An engine block could give me some pretty damn good results. I think I'm gonna go with that. I haven't upgraded the cylinder heads. What the hell am I doing in this game? I'm already hitting 420 horsepower. And I basically have a grand left to my name. Can't afford an exhaust manifold. Can't afford a better exhaust system. Let's see how much damage we could do. 
we're going to go back to that same race and see what happens. Maybe I can get better than third this time. Where was that race at? It checked it. I didn't even win it and it checked me off on it. Like, no, that's not how this works. Let's start this again and see what happens. I don't know if that's my car or someone else's, but I like the sound of that. Alright, let's do this. Hey, right, so I think we're gaining. It just looks like they're pulling away. They're just doing their world-famous rubber banding. Oh, EA, I hope you fix this in the next game. On a race like racers, not rubber bands. Now I'm squirreling all over the place. You know, I think by this time in the last race, I was already in, like, sixth place. It just went straight on me. It wouldn't even let me turn there. Come on, now. I can get him. I can get him. I can get him. Oh god, oh god, oh god. How did I know that was going to happen? Try that again. That car totally dicked me right there. Look at that beaten up poor thing. The car is worthless now. Oh, there's a cop up there. Crown Vic, that ain't nothing. Who are you going to catch on that thing, man? Oh god, there's multiple cops here. Uh-oh. And now they're trying to target me, apparently. I'm at position 6 now, because of that little fray back there. It's probably the best I'm going to get, too, because I am not catching these dudes. Yeah, I already lost them. I can see on the map already I was how far away. I wonder if by the next time this race goes around the next lap, we're going to see them. I played it for a bit six months ago, because I just wanted to mess with the cops in free roll. I can't do that payback. Yep, there it is. <laughs> I T-boned them too. So you only get the option to pull over if they catch you street races, just for Supo immediately. Get out of here. It's probably gonna be back with the vengeance now. Oh great. Man, here I am thinking I might be able to get out of third place. No, I can't even get into third place. Yay, fourth place. Awesome. I'm gonna beat this race one way or another. That's it. Done with the super nostalgia. There she is. <laughs> like the sound of that. Oh yeah, this thing's built. I think I forgot how built this thing is. Here goes. Start the event up. I hear that one. I'm gonna beat this event. I ain't settling for no fourth or third place. There wasn't a check mark before tonight, and even though I lost, it gave me a check mark. Like, hey, it's complete. Like, no, it's not. This game is pulling a fours. Like, oh, even if you lose, you win. Yeah, I'm already crushing this whole crap. Yeah, I can just in the back. Oh great! I didn't mean to do that. Oh my! It's turning to burnout. Catch these guys. Man, this race has been busted about every time we've done it. That was a perfect moment, apparently. Uh, get a little rough here. A little rough with the GTR. I'm in second place, and I'm still on like the first lap. It's weird, it's labeled as a sprint race, but it takes the same route a second time around, so why would it not be considered a circuit? Just a two-lap circuit, simple as that. Alright, this guy in the uh, GT, Mercedes-Benz AMG GT versus a Mustang GT. So you got a German GT versus an American GT. How fitting, right? Of course, the stupid American doesn't know how to drive his damn car. He keeps hitting everything. I zoom right by. Maybe not. Let me in. Let me in. There we go. Oh god. And 
that's that. Finish. I finally get a first place win. Smoked them. I just love how easy it is to, like, lose the cops. Like, if you see Need for Speed Heat gameplay, the cops are a lot more intense. This game, they're nothing. They were intense in Payback, they just weren't around. I was chilling out. I want to get into a chase. Oh. Okay, so I can pull over right now and get a hundred dollar fine. I like messing with it too. I like get behind you and like yell at you. <laughs> yeah, he's getting pissed. Yep. A resisting arrest. already going 100 and he's already like way back there. Well, he might actually get me now. Oh god. Yeah, maybe Nana's easy to escape. He's just gotta be a shitty driver. He's still sitting there on the map and I already, just like that, I lost him. I'm trying to turn around. Yeah, he ain't gonna see me. Oh snap, there he is. I escaped. I escaped. I literally just did that in front of him and I escaped apparently. Hey buddy, remember me? He's hit me, I didn't even get arrested yet. See ya. He's yelling at me on the intercom as I just pulled away. I'm already in cooldown. I'm already in cooldown. Now what was that? He was just sitting there. I could have... Why was he sitting facing the opposite way? Did he spin out? This is Need for Speed 2015 police chase. This is... This is 2015. It seems like when they go on the highways, they don't know what to do. Oops. I nicked you. Wow, I almost got busted there, are you serious? What are you gonna do, copper? Huh? Do something. I can just floor it and lose him right now if I wanted to. Whoops! See, they only get tough when you get to, like, heat level 3 or 4. Or, like, there's 3 or 4 on you. Like, I'm literally not hitting the gas. Like, I'll floor for a second and just let off. How fast can that thing go? How fast can your crown bit go? She got under the hood there. I know you can go quicker. We're going 145 right now. I know you can do. I know you can do better than that. Yeah, I'm going 140. He's just hanging out back there. Like 140, 150, they cap out at. Even then, I think that's a stretch compared to real life. Oh, he hit me. He hit me. He's just sitting back there. I'm gonna lose him again. Yeah, I'm already in cooldown. Alright, I stopped. And I did a burnout. Come on, man, where's your buddy at? I'm at heat level 2, I should have another cop showing up. There's like so many racers on the map, and then like this one cop. Like, as if this cop's gonna do anything special at all. And then my fine went up. Oh, I keep hitting the nitrous button instead of the handbrake. What am I doing? Get out of there. Oh, juked it with the U-turn, and I just know what to do. Come on, man. I'm trying to keep the chase going. Like, is that for me? Is that a roadblock? I'm seriously going to lose him. Hi, you. There you are. I didn't get, like, another level up on the heat level for, like, you know, almost outrunning you for, like, the fourth time in a row. I hit you head on. Still nothing on the heat level. 
I want to keep vandalizing your roadblock until there's nothing left. I bet you're getting pissed and want to send another unit now, don't you? How about now? Still no? I almost lost you. I keep smashing a roadblock. I keep hitting you head on. And I can't even get another cop to chase me. Where's your backup, man? I'm at heat level 3 now. Someone has to show up at some point. The roadblocks slow you down. It's a really hazard. Then eventually get thicker roadblocks that have like armored cars that you literally can't break through. There's a charger. Hi, pal. The charger's got different sirens, which I always thought was kind of cool. Man, if I get arrested now, my fine is over six grand. They don't take your car or nothing, they just take your money, and that's that. <laughs> the cop just nailed his body there. The pickup truck following me. Maybe that can just lose these two, like it's nothing immediately. Start hauling ass down the road. I'll lose them in a second. Yeah, I'm already losing sight of them. Oh, I almost flipped them. E level 3, and I only have two cops after me at the moment. doing everything I can to try to rack up more heat and get more cops on me. There's one of those roadblocks, one of those really tough roadblocks that you can't get through. And that guy just drilled right into it. See, they can ramp it up if they want to, but all they do is just put up hard roadblocks that you can't break through. Don't send more units, just set up a bunch of roadblocks. Like, what a waste of resources. And they're just going to lose me anyway. All they do is just gun a little bit. Oh look, it's not Hardy's. Totally not Hardy's. Star. Oh shit, they blocked that road and I forgot about it. I'm gonna lose them on this banner right here. In fact, I might just do that. I'm gonna lose them because I'm getting bored and I'm sure y'all are getting tired of me getting chased by the same two cops. So just like that, I'm gonna go around this corner. Oh, I'm just about out of visual range. They just see me. Over. And that was a horrible turn. Oh, they just lost because I went around that bend. Yep, they lost me. Oh wait, they spotted me somehow. I don't know where they did, they're not even on the map. Pull down once again. Now I'm gonna lose. This is enough. Just keep snaking my way up this hill. Up. Oh, uh, I escaped, and the best part is I'm sitting here right in front of the roadblock. Post 4M to 4PM. That's a hell of a roadblock time, man. I wonder if any of them came up this hill to come after me. Well, anyway, I think that's going to conclude this episode of my first nostalgia trip. I might do more playthroughs of this. This was kind of fun, but at the same time, I'll be picking up Need for Speed Heat as soon as I get back into town. And thank you for checking this out. Stay tuned for more Need for Speed Heat content. Probably going to drop another video or two. This is Street Pilot, signing out. Thank <laughs> you.